also known as Echo Day. The day celebrates nature and brings to the fore several environmental issues for a collective effort in mitigating them. With its high carbon emission, Nigeria is one of the major contributors of global environmental problems with calls for more sensitization campaigns. We're having a lot more drought, we're having more floods, the weather is changing. Right now you don't even know when it's raining season and when it's not. So the farmers are affected, the seafood is affected for those who eat seafood, um, the pollution in the air caused by greenhouse gases, caused by carbon emissions, is affecting the ozone layer, so we're getting hotter. A profound issue affecting the planet is air quality. Outdoor air pollution has grown in recent years, with billions of people now exposed to dangerous air. In 2016, the World Health Organization listed four Nigerian cities, Onicha, Kaduna, Aba and Umwahe, amongst the worst in the world for air pollution, recording 30 times more than the recommended levels. With the sheer number of vehicles in Lagos and industrialization, Africa's fastest growing city is also a contributor to the problems, raising questions as to the level of implementation of the Paris Climate Change Accord signed by President Mohamed Buhari alongside all the world leaders in 2016. We have in Nigeria, with a lot of things, environment is um, also one of them. It's monitoring, okay? You pass regulations, anybody can pass regulations, but are you monitoring and are you enforcing? You know, because for example, I was just talking about um, generators. There should be a law that there should be um, the pipe um, coming out from the generators should be at elbow level so that the whatever is being emitted, uh, emitted is going up to there. That's bad enough, but this is not going directly into the house or into the offices where people are. With the theme of this year's celebration being connecting with nature, there is a renewed call for inhabitants of planet Earth to find fun and exciting ways to experience nature and have the consciousness to make it safe. Joseph Oko, Galaxy News, Lagos.